what he was able to in the early 90s. Somebody else, he didn't say. Really. Danny Boy and uh, I just seen him the other day. Uh, Young Buck. Okay. Not Young Buck from G Unit. L.A. Buck. L.A. Buck, yeah. Okay. We had left, and um, Danny Boy did a lot of shit for sure, like, you know, his personal shit, like, pick the kids up. Shit like that. They had their own relationship. Right. And um, when we came back, we doubled back for something. And we went up to the penthouse. And uh, they was up there at 690. Yeah, they was, they was giving each other all sex. Mm. I know Young Buck. I just seen him the other day. You know, he all right with me, but the truth is the truth. Mm. Um, years after that, it came to me that he was about to, he was with my homegirl, mm. Danny Boy. So I tried to warn my homegirl, like we grew up two houses from each other. Mm -hmm. I called and like, yo, you can't do that. And like, she was genuinely in love with him, you know? And I'm like, yo, you can't do that, dude, it ain't right. Mm -hmm. She got mad at me, told me I was hating mm -hmm. and not happy for her. And I'm telling her like, yo, you can't do that, you can't do that. She cussed me out a little bit. She went on to marry him. They went to Atlanta. And a uh, child was born. Everything seemed normal. And then one day, a tell-all book came out. And that's when she called me and said you was telling me the truth. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that definitely. But then one thing about Danny, he, you know, he comfortable in his skin. Yeah. He don't care less. He he gonna tell you what it is. Yeah. He comfortable in the skin. 